there's our toilet. What can you tell us? Well, what we're looking for on a toilet is to see if the water is overflowing into the drainage part of the toilet, mm -hmm. or if a flapper is leaking itself, it could be allowing water to go from the tank into the bowl. Okay. And so what we're looking for is movement. So what we've done previously is we put in some dye tablets and just a blue dye in the toilet to see if water is actually leaking from the tank into the bowl, which is going to allow the water level to come up and then flow down to the sewer line, which is a waste of water. So that's what we're looking for. So as we remove the tank, you can see that we have the blue dye inside the tank. And what we want to see is if that blue dye is now making its way into the toilet itself. So as we lift this up, we can see that there is no blue dye in there. And what I can do is I can simulate what that's going to look like by just lifting up the flapper, uh, just kind of showing what a leak would, would look like. So as we lift this up, you'll start to see the water turn blue, and there it goes. So that's what you're looking for. If the, if the tank was leaking in the bowl, this is what would show up. And that's what we're looking for, because that's going to add, add up and cost you money, and, uh, and, and it's losing our precious resource of water running down the toilet. So that's what we want to look for, because that's dollars adding up quickly inside of a home.